Welcome to our channel, where we explore important health topics. Today, we're diving into diabetes mellitus type 1, a chronic condition that affects millions worldwide. Type 1 diabetes is an autoimmune disorder where the body's immune system mistakenly attacks insulin-producing beta cells in the pancreas, leading to little or no insulin production. Insulin is crucial for regulating blood sugar levels by allowing glucose to enter cells for energy. The exact cause of type 1 diabetes is not fully understood, but genetic and environmental factors play significant roles. It often develops in childhood or early adulthood, hence the name juvenile diabetes, but it can occur at any age. Symptoms can appear suddenly and may include increased thirst, frequent urination, extreme fatigue, and blurred vision. Other signs might include unexplained weight loss, irritability, or mood changes. Diagnosis typically involves blood tests. The fasting blood sugar test checks levels after not eating for 8 hours, while the A1C test measures average blood glucose levels over the past 2 to 3 months. A diagnosis is confirmed if blood sugar levels are significantly elevated or if symptoms of hyperglycemia are present. Managing type 1 diabetes is a lifelong commitment. Insulin therapy is the cornerstone of treatment, requiring regular injections or the use of an insulin pump. Patients need to monitor their blood sugar levels frequently, often several times a day, to understand how their body responds to food, exercise, and insulin. This monitoring is vital for avoiding complications like hypoglycemia, which occurs when blood sugar levels drop too low, leading to symptoms like shaking, sweating, and even loss of consciousness. Education and awareness are crucial for effective self-management. Patients must learn how to balance carbohydrates, fats, and proteins in their diet, as these macronutrients impact blood sugar levels differently. Continuous glucose monitoring systems, or CGMs, have become increasingly popular, providing real-time glucose readings and alerts for high or low levels. In addition to insulin and diet, regular physical activity is beneficial. Exercise lowers blood sugar levels and improves overall health, but it requires careful planning to prevent hypoglycemia during and after workouts. Psychological support is also vital. Living with type 1 diabetes can be challenging, and mental health should be prioritized. Long-term complications can arise if diabetes is not managed well. These might include cardiovascular diseases, nerve damage, kidney damage, eye damage, and foot problems. Regular checkups with healthcare providers are essential for monitoring and preventing these complications. Additionally, ongoing research is paving the way for advancements in treatment, including closed-loop systems and potential vaccines aimed at preventing type 1 diabetes. It's important for those living with type 1 diabetes and their families to stay informed and connected with support groups and organizations dedicated to diabetes care. In conclusion, while diabetes mellitus type 1 poses significant challenges, effective management strategies can lead to a healthy and fulfilling life. With proper education, regular monitoring, and a supportive community, individuals living with type 1 diabetes can thrive. If you found this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe for more educational content. Thank you for watching, and remember, taking charge of your health is the first step towards a better life with diabetes.